I am currently watching the Olympics. I don't know if you guys get into the Olympics or not, but I have loved the Olympics since I was a little girl. And I remember when I was little, my two favorite events were ice skating and gymnastics. It was very huge in my house. Um, so one of my faves, but now I have also grown to really love the swimming, the diving, and all of the other interesting events too, like precision, precision shooting. Well, there's a lot more that I love. I just can't think of them at the top of my head. And I'm just kind of like, I am, you know, American from the United States, um, but I'm not partial just because of that. I am like a team earth kind of girl. I mean, just may the best person win, may the best team win. I know all of these people work extremely hard and I'm just happy for, you know, everyone that's made it to this, this far and just going after their dreams. So I'm really happy to watch them, but I have to say that gymnastics, I am very excited to see the US um, team and see what they're going to do. All right, so today I'm gonna do a Bath and Body Works haul. I haven't been to Bath and Body Works in over a year. And I just kind of was feeling like, you know what, I need some hand soaps and I've been buying them from Walmart. But now that fall is kind of around the corner and upon us, I just thought, you know what, I want to go check out Bath & Body Works and see what scents they've come out with. So, and I had a 25% off coupon, which I get in my email. So if you sign up for Bath & Body Works, you can get like the, you know, emails and all of their deals and stuff like that. So I wanted to go ahead and go over there this morning and check it out. And I got a bag full of stuff. Everything was so darn cute that I wanted it all, but I didn't get it all but I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I did get. Before I get started, I just wanna say that Bath & Body Works is not really a place that I obsess too much over. Um, it's kind of like a place where I shop every once in a while, you know, because their candles are like very popular and their deals are very popular and they have really amazing scents, but I will say that I still stand by the fact that I feel like Walmart's candles are just as good. I will tell you my favorite of all time is raspberry ice. It's my favorite. I always have them on hand. Um, but you know, Bath and Body Works is just one of these places where it's just so girly and it's just fun to shop in. So it's really almost a mentality, but you can get just as amazing products in other places as well. So let's take a look at what I got. Socks. Now I get, I got a couple of these last year and what I did with them um, I put them in my daughter's calendar advent bag. So I guess it's been, what, eight months, I guess? I thought, I thought it was a year, but eight months since I went shopping in December there. But I got her a couple of these really cute socks and put them in her little advent calendar bag. And I saw this little raccoon. And I was like, um, yeah. And you can't feel this, but let me tell you, it feels like bada. Okay, this is just so smooth. And they also have the little grippers which is great if your house has like wood flooring like mine. And this pair was $8.50. That's a lot for some socks, but they are adorable and worth it. And they wash extremely well too. So the next thing that I got were the hand soaps. They were four for 20. This is initially what I went into Bath & Body Works for. Um, I just kind of felt like I was in the mood to have some really good, luxurious hand soaps around the house. And I will say that these do last quite a while. They last a lot longer than the ones that I get from Walmart. And you know what else I use these for? I use these to clean my um, my beauty blender. So I just use some hand soap to clean my beauty blenders and it does the trick. So I love these for that as well. And the first one that I got was Sunlight and Apple Trees. And let me tell you, if Sunlight and Apple Trees had a scent, this would be it. I gravitate towards anything that has an apple, strawberry, pretty much every fruit, pear, lemons, any fruit scent I gravitate towards. And it does kind of break down on the side what scents are in here. And it says crisp apple and white birchwood. So if those two combos sound great to you, then this will be a great hand soap for you. The next one is autumn vines. Now, right now, uh, Bath and Body Works has an entire fall collection. 
and they went with like a very vineyard theme. So I thought that was really cool. But as I was like going around the shop and smelling them, it was a lot of hits and misses for me, but I think that's just how it goes, right? I mean, you're attracted to only a certain type of scent and then the other scents like musk or things like that, you're really probably not attracted to. So it's like one or the other, if that makes any sense. So this one, I was surprised that I really liked and when I was smelling it, I was like feeling like there was an orange flavor to it and a scent, not a flavor because I wasn't eating it, but it says Valencia orange, luscious white grape and oak barrel musk. So it does break it down what, um, what the scent smells like. So I thought that was really cool. And also I do go for the deep cleansing hand soaps. I don't go for the foam. Um, at all. And I'm obsessed with the packaging. I think that their packaging this year is perfect. I love it. When I walked in there, I was like, I don't like half of these scents, but I want to buy it all anyway, just for the packaging alone. I mean, look at the like coppery, goldy lid. I just think that's gorgeous. So it just looks so nice and I think will display really nicely throughout your home. The next one that I got was Peach Bellini. So if you don't know what a Bellini is, it's an Italian drink that has champagne and peaches in it. And peach Bellini has a delicious twist of juicy peach, white apricot, and fresh mango. So if those combos sound good to you, then you're going to love peach Bellini. And let me tell you, it really does smell like a peach Bellini. So I don't know how they're making that champagne smell, maybe the white apricot, but this smells fantastic. I can't wait to use this. And I will tell you that this scent is pretty darn close to my number one favorite bath and body Works soap of all time. And they no longer make it. And it's called Clementine. And I don't know if anyone remembers that scent. Um, but I was obsessed with it last year, summertime, and they no longer make it. And it makes me want to write them a letter, honestly, because I think it was one of the most perfect scents of all time. And Peach Bellini comes really close, in my opinion. The fourth one that I got, because I did go for four for 20, um, but I really should have gone for the six for 24, because for four extra dollars, I could have got two more, so I don't know why I did that. So I feel like that's a little trick. Really, honestly, if you're... If you're gonna go for something like that, I would probably go for the six for 24. But I did get Kitchen Lemon. So I love anything lemon scent, especially for the kitchen, because I do have the Limoncello uh, lotion still. I mean, I've had that Limoncello lotion for a while now. I probably should check the expiration date. But um, yeah, so this one is a fresh blend of zesty lemon, sparkling citrus, and Italian, um, I don't even know how to say this word, Bergamo? Bergamot? Italian bergamo? Bergamot? I don't even know. I don't know if the T's silent. I don't know if the G's silent. But this is just a lovely lemon scent. It's not too harsh. It's not too bam lemon in your face. It's like this really beautiful underlining lemon scent. Um, it's just perfect. Honestly, this is a really great lemon scent. I mean, it's, it is. It's great. Now let's dive into my candles. Again, for me, it's very difficult to buy candles at Bath & Body Works because the back of my mind is going $3.33 at Walmart and um, those candles all smell great. There's a huge variety of scents, but Bath & Body Works, like I said, it's like this place where you just can't help it. It's like you get in the mood and it's just really a feeling more than you're buying like the best candle out there. Um, first one that I got was Cranberry Woods, and these, this size, I got another one, was two for 20. So I thought that was, mm, mm, mm. that's a lot. That's a lot for these little candles, you guys. That's a lot. Um, cranberry Woods smells like cranberry in the woods, you guys. I mean, if I could just have you all smell I really love this smell, I'm not gonna lie. And I will say that I didn't see this in a bigger candle. I only saw it in this small size because I love this smell so much that I wanted a bigger candle. There's something about buying scents that match up with the season that makes everything so warm and cozy, you know what I mean? The next one that I got 
Oh yeah, I forgot that I traded it. I thought I got Autumn Sunshine, which smelled really great, um, but then I thought of getting a candle for my daughter. So I got the all ever popular Marshmallow Fireside. So I know this is like a very popular one and it smells like a good old marshmallow, you guys. It's very nice scent, I'm not gonna lie. I really can, I can see why it would be so popular. It's very nice. But I got this for the, um, the new room that we just made over. I thought this would be a really good color combo and I know that she likes this scent. The next candle that I got, I did get a giant candle and it was because the candles that have the leaves on, or the leaf on top were $15. So they're new candles that just came out for that vintage line, the vintage vineyard line. So any of the Merlots or um, those, that new line, I think is regular priced at $22.50. But the candles that have the leaf on the lid um, are currently running for $15 each. So I went with Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. And you guys. I mean, I literally wanna just scoop my finger in here and eat it. It, lit it smells like whipped cream, a hint of caramel, and a little bit of pumpkin. It is the perfect scent for me and my scent. Honestly, it's so yummy. Oh, it is so yummy. And this candle right here, I will burn as I'm setting up my home for fall decor. I mean, it will just get me into the spirit and I'm all about that. I love that. And see, I love doing things like that. It's just the smallest things just because I don't have like the most extravagant lifestyle. But like just burning a fall candle and putting in a cute little fall movie while decorating, that makes me so happy. I'm, and I'm surprised. When I smelled this, I was very surprised because I'm not really a pumpkin smell kind of girl. But this, again, marshmallow pumpkin latte is delicious. All right, so the last thing that I got, so I'll keep my candle out. I never purchased one of these before, but I saw it and I was like, I have to. I mean, duh. And you know how Bath & Body Works makes the little candle holders? You should see the candle holders that they have out. And they make them for all of their candle sizes, the little baby ones, the little medium ones like this. So many cute candle holders. And I saw this one and I was like, I'm dead, I'm done. I need this and it has glitter. That is actually real glitter. Well, yeah, I mean, it's, you see that on my finger? So, and I love it. And then you just pop your little candle in here. I mean, I love this. So this cost, let me see, this was $9.50, um, but I figured, you know, if I take really good care of it, and when I package it away after fall is over, I mean, this will be part of my decor forever. So I thought that was a very good deal. Um, and I do have plans to go back and get more because the line of these candle holders was so stunning. I was like, really, Bath & Body Works is really doing things right. And I even saw like their whole summer collection that I missed out on, the little plugins, the designs. I was just like, whoa, like they really have just, it's just been amazing what it, what their lines look like now versus last year. So I'm very impressed. And I will say that I'm gonna be making another trip back to Bath & Body Works before fall is over and I'll be getting more of these. Okay guys, so that is the end of my haul. I hope that you really liked it. Um, let me know if you guys wanna see um, if, I, if I ever go back to Bath & Body Works, just comment down below or give this video a thumbs up if you want to see my next haul or the things that I purchased from there because I do have plans to take my daughter back and let her pick out a couple of scents. Plus, I'm gonna be purchasing some of their um, like body care so some of their sprays so anyway so if you're interested just comment down below let me know otherwise this is my haul i hope that you enjoyed it go to bath and body works if nothing just to check out the scents um because let me tell you some of them are pretty pretty good and before you go there's always some sort of deal so make sure that you check their website check for any deals that they have like right now i know they have the 25 percent off and i think they are doing free shipping so if you're not a go into the store kind of person then do the free shipping. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and keep watching the Olympic Games and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.